Now everyone who walks into Hawaii News Now passes by our unofficial wall of fame. Filled with memories from legendary broadcasts that were produced in the studios of KGMB, KHNL, and K5. Well now we're about to turn the page on another era in H&N history. All right, what's been happening behind this wall will literally reshape our stations. After more than a decade of the same news desk and that frosted glass background, we're finally getting a new set. It's been a long time coming. We wanted to give you a look into what went into this epic design process. Our look has lagged behind from the product that we put out on a daily basis. And with this new set, I think we're now right on par with the great work that the men and women of Hawaii News Now put out every day. The engineering team and the IT team had to come up with uh, wiring diagrams of, of, of how we thought we needed to um, change the facility from what it was to what it is and keep us on the air now. It got all put together um, and put on a tractor trailer, brought over to the West Coast and then shipped in a container here. Once it arrived, it got unpacked, uh, literally unpacked it all in about three hours. It's more than a long time coming. Hawaii News Now worked with Devlin Design Group to design and implement a new set that would connect the station to the community. It needed to be a set that uh, really belongs and uh, captures the beauty of Hawaii. So we have used colors, textures, and materials that uh, really captures the natural feel and showcases the beauty of Hawaii. Our previous set was really dark. It did not reflect Hawaii in this bright paradise that we live in. This new set, the first thing you notice is how bright it is, how live it is. You see the blues, the blues of our oceans. You see the brown boards, there's stripes in it. It's meant to look like those old school surfboards, the traditional surfboards from back in the day. And then you see the brick section. It's not like a red brick, it's like a coral brick. So everything is meant to highlight Hawaii and our surroundings here at home. The design focused on maximizing storytelling venues to better share the news, weather and traffic stories of Hawaii. The set has been designed to be really presentation focused with multiple presentation areas in both the studios. Uh, we have a nine by one portrait array behind the main anchor desk, which also doubles up as a walk and talk storytelling wall. It's kind of a hot spot in that coral block. Needless to say, there are a few growing pains. We've been working out. Two on the left. Okay, that was it. This is a set that has a lot of monitors. So my guys have to get used to uh, filling all the monitors with the correct things. It could be weather graphics, it could be video, it can be full screeners. Uh, so there are some challenges, but the rehearsals have been going really, really well. We are expecting some really nice conditions out there, although things are going to... Someone who's been a huge player in the Hawaii broadcast scene is former HNN general manager and current Honolulu mayor Rick Blangiardi. Our cameras were rolling when he took a tour of the new digs. Um, you know, to have the vertical and to have the big wide one in here like this and the monitor like that, it's just uh, the color is beautiful. I think the set needs to look like it's responsible and not dated. And you want to look big market. I mean, Honolulu is a big city. And I think we want to have that sophistication. And it's, of course, it's a statewide news organization. So I just wanted to say a huge thank you to all of you for the work that it's taken to make this happen. To have the ability to be able to refresh our look and actually meet the technology of how people are consuming our product in a very modern way, that is just a huge accomplishment. I also believe it's another big piece of this is that we serve all of the islands of Hawaii and now we'll have screens all around all of the people doing this work to be able to tell those stories in a very fresh, modern way. While the new set is also packed with technology, everyone at HNN agrees it's not a fancy makeover that makes Hawaii News Now shine. I think we've learned in the last year with the pandemic how much we really do mean to the community in the sense of, you know, we've always been there for hurricanes and 
missile crisis and stuff like that. But the pandemic showed, you know, on a daily basis, literally for almost a year, that we were putting out major information that people wanted to know. I think, you know, 12 years ago when we moved in here and we changed the name from the call letters of KGMB and KHNL and K5 to Hawaii News Now, it all begins with the first word, Hawaii. So it's all about the state, it's all about, you know, the people of Hawaii and making sure that we can bring them news, not just from Oahu, but from across the state. Your source for breaking news. And first at five. And during breaking news, you know, we get flooded with videos all over the state, all over the world. So this really allows us to showcase each of those videos. And it's gonna allow us to do a lot more with the way we tell the news. Plus, it just looks good. Content is always the priority for us here in Hawaii News Now. We know that you tune in because you love the stories that we have. We, you love the reporters that bring you those stories. What this is gonna do is it's gonna allow us to bring you those stories and tell them much more visually. We're in full prep mode right now, practicing, and oh, the countdown has begun. Boy, this set is gonna be exciting, it's gonna be brighter, it's gonna be a real reflection of where we live, and I like that, the warmth and the honesty that comes through. And what a great way for us to showcase all of our hard work right up there, front and center, for you to see. So as you can see, we're really excited. And get this, Hawaii News Now's new look will debut next week. We can't wait, we'll see you then. Aloha.